Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Sunday, March 3rd, 2024. I'm the Drunk Folk Guru. Tis Trapel time. International Trapel Day. Today is a good day for a Trapel. Every day is a good day for a Trapel, am I right? But thanks to our pal Craft Beer Days for getting this going. This year has 15 participating breweries across Canada and the U.S. That's fantastic. People making Trapels. Belgian beers are a massive part of the reason why I started drinking better beer. 100% and seeing them made locally is awesome. Now I have three from the LCBO in the fridge, but this one I've hung on to for a year. One of the best Belgian style producers in Canada, I may say in the world. Our friends at Muse Brewing, this is their 2023 Trapel, Belgian style Trapel, 9%. I've been sitting in this, on this, in the cellar for a year, waiting for today. Now they have three different Trapels that I believe if you're out in Norfolk County there, you can go pick some up. Uh, if you don't have any at a local brewery, you can go to the LCBO and pick some up. I can't find my Trapel glass. I'll have to use my West Mall glass. It's such a busy day. Let's get into it. You got to see. You can't drink all day if you don't start in the morning. Um, I love this day. I think this is a wonderful thing to celebrate. Three, three, drinking Trapels all day. Uh, we, we should do Quad Day in April, right? I think we say that every year and then we forget. But maybe we'll remember this year. You know, the thing with these beers... They can, there is some variance in the style, right? And you gotta, what, what gets accentuated in each version of it is always incredible. I, I'm looking forward, because I'm doing three classic ones that I've had many, many times. Um, I haven't had this in a year, so I'm very excited about that. But I hope you have a trapel to our pal Craft Beer Days. Thank you for organizing this. Let's get into it. Cheers. It's a wonderful, wonderful thing. It's been sitting in the cellar for a year. And the thing is, this is cellar temp. It's not ice cold. And I don't want my beer to be ice cold. Uh, cold should never be a flavor of your beer. If you notice, that's a selling point for a lot of macro lagers. And, and, and craft beer lager. Cold. Cold's not a selling point. Anyways, this is beautiful cellar temp. You are definitely getting that kind of bubblegum, orange peel, lemon zest up front. Right? Then comes in that clove, that coriander, that peppery spice. Spicy back end. This is a beautiful rendition of a classic style of beer. Now, to celebrate something is to kind of immerse yourself in it for the day. And I'm going to do that. I'm going to have four trapels today, I hope. <laughs> and I'm going to do some, some reading, some research, uh, Belgian beer research. I like to immerse myself in the culture of the beer. Um, the dream was always to go to Belgium. I really don't think that's going to happen anymore, but that's okay. I don't need to go anywhere. I can sit right here and drink amazing Belgian-style beer made in Ontario. <sighs> Today is a good day for a Trapel. Today is a wonderful day to be alive. Cheers, my friends, to a great day. Like, I could just drink this one beer all day and be very, very happy. This is effervescent. It is utterly delicious. <laughs> 